Hey, what's up ladies and gentlemen, my name is Seth, or Egoat, and welcome back to a brand new video. Now, um, I'm, I'm gonna be real quick about these patch notes, by the way, but uh, if you guys like the content that I'm making, uh, go ahead and subscribe if you uh, like the video. Uh, like the video, be much appreciated. Also, give me some comments down below, whether it's criticism or telling me I'm doing a good job. Be much appreciated to kind of understand what you guys like and what you guys don't like. And I'm just trying to make content for you guys. And speaking of content, Valorant 2.03 patch notes is out today. Now, I didn't get to really see this all too much, so this is my this is my first reaction. Uh, there was a lot that's happening today um, that includes Euro, Reyna, Brim, and Phoenix. And I don't know what the update's all about. So we're going to zoom in here and see what this is about. Okay, Reyna's update. Uh, dual nerf and buff in hopes of reigning in, her, in some of her pub stomp potential. While still keeping her vi viable and balance and coordinated play. The charge reduction should limit how much impact she can have round over round when she's heavily outgun her, uh, outgunning her opponents. But allow enough room for the 1v5 dream, then Empress is active. When Empress is active. Oh! So her ultimate's gonna be more key now with her. Let's see. Maximum Devour and Dismiss. Charges reduce from 4 to 2. Wow! They fucking nerfed her to the floor, man! Jesus, there's only two of them now? Slain enemies that Reyna has damaged in the last three seconds now drop soul orbs, even if Reyna does not land the killing shot. Euro, all right, Euro, my, my main man. Not really main man, you suck ass. What is your change? I wanna know. Gate crash, which is his uh, little fucking teleport. Now displays a range at which the tether can be seen by enemies while moving on the mini map. Interesting, okay. I like that. So people will know now whether or not it's around them or not. And I appreciate that. Not only that, it's also good for Euro mains because if someone wants to teleport, uh, they want to make sure they're not teleporting into some some random guy. I appreciate that. The range that enemies are able to hear the audio of gate crash teleports is now delayed or displayed on the mini map. Good change. I like that. Uh, dimensional drift. While in Dimensional Drift, Euro's minimap is now visible. Enemies within Euro's vision range, uh, range, while in Dimensional Drift, are now revealed to ally minimaps as well. Uh, last uh, change is Dimensional Drift can no longer body block enemies. So you can go through enemies now. Interesting. I like that. Brimstone. Interesting. D interesting change. The audio of the Incendiaries linger... <clears throat> Lingering fire zone will be easier to hear when others action when other actions and sounds occur nearby. Sorry, I know I'm like speaking in tongues for a little bit here and there. I just woke up. I apologize. Uh, for this, doesn't really change too much, it's whatever. Uh this must be the sea has the same thing. So Phoenix and Brimstone's mollies now are a little better to hear. They're easier to hear. Let's see the marshal. Let's see the fucking marshal. Okay. Uh, now is 90% of unzoom movement speed. Interesting. I like that. So people are a lot faster now while aiming down the sights. I appreciate that. The price has decreased by 100, which is not really a big deal, but it is also a big deal because now you can choose between a stinger or a marshal unless the stinger has a change in price, which I'm assuming it will. We'll have to see. Uh, but the zoom in mag magnification is a huge, huge buff. Stinger, full auto fire. So it increased to 100. So it's now the Marshall's uh, original price. Interesting. They decreased the full auto rate of fire from 18 to 16. But that's not going to be a really big deal because Reyna and Brimstone mains are going to be able to put down like different types of abilities to increase their fire rate anyway. So it doesn't really matter. So, it's going to be interesting how that's going to play out if you guys don't have a Brimstone and or Arena. <clears throat> Full auto fire now reaches a max spread of 4 bullets instead of 6 bullets. I like that. I appreciate that. I don't know why that wasn't there in the first place for a Stinger, but, you know, whatever. Adjust the pitch, vertical recoil curve for full auto. Recoil climbs more aggressively past the third bullet. Okay. So, now you have to actually be skilled with it, but, I mean... You're not gonna, you're not really gonna have a big deal with with the recoil, if you're gonna be at close range, right? I mean, it doesn't matter. 
And medium range might be different, so that might be the mastery, is medium range stinger fights. I can understand that. Decrease yaw switch bullet prote uh, protection at full auto count from 4 to 3 on full auto. Interesting. Okay, so the burst fire is changed as well. Adjust the per uh, perch. Uh, adjust the pitch uh, vertical recoil to be more aggressive after the first burst. Added more error on burst after the first one. Improve they improve the recovery time on the burst mode from 0.45 to 0.4. Frenzy. Holy shit. Increase the price range. This is 500. So we're going to be at the range for a second. Um, we're going to see all the new changes. So we're going to play Reyna because he's she, she's the biggest change. She's the huge, biggest change of all time. Yeah, there's only two of them. Wow. And they both cost like, what, 200? 200 each? Fuck. She's been nerfed to the fucking floor, man. So the Frenzy's got a nerf. Got 500. Still a good weapon all around. We can't really buy light armor with it. Stinger. Biggest change. Let's see here. So I don't know what the original spray sp uh, spray was. Uh, so I want to see. Oh, wow. That's definitely harder to control. It's not. That's what the original fire rate used to be. But now it's been reduced. Man, that's crazy. Holy shit. Wow. That is fucking ridiculous how slow the fire rate is now. I appreciate it, actually. Wow. Now let's check out the marshal here. Okay. Oh, dude. I appreciate that change. Wow. That's going to be very useful for early game rounds. Let's see if Euro is going to be good today. So let's let's do the thing, right? Euro's thing. There. Oh, dude. Look at that. So I wish there was a dotted line that tells you. I, I appreciate the mini map showing it, but I want to see if they have like a dotted line if they ever were to do that for this so that I know as a Euro main whether or not they're going to cross into it or not. Okay. I think that's it for, for everyone. I'm going to play Reyna in uh, Unranked to see how she plays out and whether or not I'm going to like her or not. I'm also going to play out uh, Euro as well. Uh, today, by the way, ladies and gentlemen. Today, 12 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. If you guys want to chill out and hang out, come with me uh, to watch the stream. Be much appreciated. A uh, little, little self-promo there. But, yeah. That's it for the update. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. I'll see you guys all later. If you're going to do something good, be good at it. If you're going to do something bad, be good at it as well. And yeah, see you guys all later, okay? Deuces. Take care, everyone.